In my last video, I talked about if a child has an organic problem or issue and the parent experiences it as a behavior that the child is doing on purpose, it can get into a dynamic that's very much a relational problem. Like if the child has a need to hang upside down off of the chair at the dinner table and put their legs up in the air and that's really annoying to the parent and they start to think, oh, I think that my child is flaunting my authority or doing it on purpose in order to get more attention than their little brother or something like that, then it becomes this relational issue. So I want you as a parent to become aware of when you have those thoughts in your head that, oh, he's doing it on purpose. Okay, well, there is likely an aspect where he is, the child has now learned, yeah, this is something that, this is what we do. This is a dance between mom and me. And this is something that she expects. And I'm asking myself, am I doing it on purpose? Well, let me check, let me test it out and see if I get the same response. So it's, it's a dance. And so as a parent, it's really helpful to slow down and just observe your child's behavior. So if they're hanging upside down or they're wiggling in their seat, there is likely an aspect of something that they need. They're getting something, a need met. And rather than thinking of it as something that they're doing on purpose, they should be over it, they're older by now, um, think of it as there's something that they're getting out of it that is helpful to them, that's regulating to them, that's soothing to them. And so it helps you to not think of it so much as a behavior issue. And that's the first part of slowing this process down. You might get curious about it, like think, what is the uh, possible reason or need that he's getting met if he's always trying to get upside down and put his head underneath his feet maybe it's something that makes him feel good and then you can say something like oh yeah that feels really good and then you can say um you know right after dinner i'm going to help you do a headstand something that is both addressing the need and accepting it and then making some suggestion about how you're going to um, manage the behavior in a positive way.